China is now accusing the U.S. of spreading fear after new travel restrictions were imposed, including a mandatory 14-day quarantine on returning U.S. citizens who have been in certain parts of China. So, Dr. Drew, are we overreacting? Yes. As yes. Mm. Yes. I'm hearing this from doctors left and right. Yes, it, and we are not overreacting. The press is overreacting, and it makes me furious. The press should not be reporting medical stories as though they know how to report it. We will, if we have a pandemic, I won't know how to tell that we're actually having a pandemic because everything is an emergency. Mm. People that are infectious disease specialists, the CDC, the epidemiologists, need to take this very seriously. The press needs to shut up mm. because you're more likely to die of influenza that's right, what it, right that's now. What, that's right what now. doctors are saying. However, and may. I'm not trying to go against you, but I have a question. It is now beat SARS in terms of fatalities, 362, and they're saying. But its spreads, fatality rate is right. still lower. But they're saying it's, it spreads fast. It's that, a mild illness. It spreads all over the place, and it's only out of these 17,000 inf documented infected. I bet there's hundreds of thousands of cases, 300 deaths. Okay. And always in immunocompromised people, always in people that okay. are at risk for these sorts of things. If they get a severe viral respiratory infection, whether it's flu or corona or whatever, all of these can hurt people who. Who are compromised they can the rest of us need to wash our hands carefully get our influenza vaccines listen to the cdc if there's a problem they will let us know the Th cdc made contained. it very clear that 5,000 people just in the last two weeks have died from the flu Thank here you. in america and alone why are we panicked about that three no people died on the streets of los angeles this morning mm. from homelessness why wow. if that were coronavirus people would freak the hell out You're right why aren't we putting our parties in the right place it's the press the press does not know how to report on medical issues it's where i first learned should about we have fake consultants news. how could we how could we fix this fix this uh, when Anthony Fauci who's one of their leaders in infectious disease gets on a national news broadcast and goes don't worry about it stop worrying about it Good to and know. then if there's some data where he says we need to worry about it then oh you report God. on it otherwise shut up get that, your flu that, vaccine we, we talked about this briefly when we were walking in my car and it was really great to get your opinion on this I were you I, talking I, to the car last night yeah <laughs> you, you want to talk about this Wait, yes. well you know people always say we want to get money out of hey, politics oh. but I always say well what about getting money out of clickbait and I feel like the coronavirus virus will always yep. have people click on it. Yep. The flu will not. And yes. I think that that's why the coronavirus is at the forefront of everything you look at because people are looking at that. Yep. And I don't right. know, is the flu just not sexy enough anymore for no, people to care? No, it's not. Because it's not. And they, again, you're right. They're motivated by getting the eyeballs. And the eyeballs come with some exotic infection as opposed to saying influenza killed 5,000 mm -hmm. people. Like, oh, well, right. I guess it does that. Oh, a new infection. This is the one. It's going to get us. No, it's not. Mm -hmm. Stop it. Be, be professional journalists. Be what you're supposed to be and collate and present.